people who showed up just laugh and have a good time? Yeah, see Dana and have no idea who I am. <laughs> cool. I'm Abby Drake, by the way. How are you guys doing? Good, good, good. You know, well, well, you're looking at me weird. You guys are you're hoping for a hot 22-year-old to get up here. Instead, you get the love child of Rachel Maddow and the Karate Kid. <laughs> So where, where are my whiskey drinkers out there? Any whiskey drinkers? Yeah. Yeah. Like to see where you're sitting, because we're the crazy ones. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I'm talking about? And I'm, this is Jameson too. Cheers to you. Cheers. <laughs> my drugs and spice are actually a whiskey and Adderall. Because you know, you got to have a downer with your upper, right? This balances all the crazy out that way. <laughs> No, but I've been trying to come up with a new drug that'll help me like people more. Because whiskey, that just makes you hate people more. <laughs> and Adderall just makes you be able to concentrate on one person at a time to hate. <laughs> and Molly, that little whore, she just, she just makes you want to touch people you hate. <laughs> yes, this, is, this is fun, I like you. I feel like I can tell you things. <laughs> It wasn't too long ago, my mom asked me if it was her fault that I'm gay. I said, yes it is. Because <laughs> I like to make her feel bad for all the other messed up shit about me that is her fault, you know? <laughs> so I said, had you just bought me Ken to go with Barbie that one year for Christmas? <laughs> all this could have been avoided. So I'd had Ken, I wouldn't have had to cut Malibu Barbie's hair short. <laughs> dresser of my brother's G.I. Joe jumpsuit. This is the most messed up part. I actually did this. I took a rock and I pounded my Barbie's boobs in with it. Like, ta-da, boy doll, you know? F to M Barbie. Then I started a really great neighborhood business performing Barbie sex changes for all the other kids. It's pretty lucrative. <laughs> No, my mom's great. She, she actually she had a really hard time with me being queer for a long time, but um, now she's, uh, I don't know, how do I put this up? Now she's too accepting. Yes. She, really, like one time she came over for dinner, and she goes, sweetie, could you pass me the dressing? And are you a top or a bottom, dear? <laughs> And I hate that. I hate that question because I like I don't ever, never know how to. I'm not really like a top or a bottom per se. I'm more of a um, a rotisserie. <laughs> oh, she's not really great with the computer, my mom. So she uh, talked me into doing some genealogy research for my family, and. Uh, it's interesting because what I'm finding is that one side of my family tree has a lot of money and royalty running through its branches, but the other side, my mom's side, just has a bunch of Jack Daniels and empty cans of Rainier beer. <laughs> Put that together, you guys, and this is what you get if the Kardashians did wife swap with the Duck Dynasty family. <laughs> I pull a little bit more from the Duck Dynasty side, really, but nothing about these hips, say Kardashian. <laughs> You guys are cute. <laughs> Here's something I wouldn't recommend. Um, I did this. I played cards against humanity with my parents. And don't do that. It's not a good idea. This is a bad, it's an awkward idea. Yeah. My mom was like, I, I don't understand this card. Could somebody please explain to me what queefing means? <laughs> Flashlight. Oh. Now I need more therapy. <laughs> Any parents out there? Anybody have kids? Yeah. How many kids do you have? You just have one? Well, hey, you're free tonight, man. Let's drink to that. Yeah, drink. Cheers. Cheers. Of course, really, I'll drink to just about anything. <laughs> Anybody have a dog? <laughs> Two dogs. <laughs> um, I have I have a teenager and they're evil little bastards. <laughs> you guys, some of you look confused. 
I went through a phase in college. <laughs> Bam! Kid, just like that. <laughs> but my son, we've been having kind of some like bonding moments lately. Like he just told me that one of the best things about being raised by two moms is um, he's the only kid that can go sing karaoke with his friends and just rock every Melissa Etheridge song. <laughs> The disadvantage is he can't remember the names of all the aunties he's had over the years. <laughs> but you know how you know they say that like gay people should have kids because they'll make them gay, right? So not true. Because like I've always thought it'd be really fun to have a gay son, you know? So I've been trying my damnedest to make this one fabulous. <laughs> he's not going for it. <laughs> Like, I think, I think we might have to learn to accept him for who he is. <laughs> he was born this way in love. <laughs> I like you guys so much. I was, um, I was performing in Yakima last weekend. Because my career is on fire. <laughs> Oh, he came up to me after the show and he goes, so are you really gay or is that just part of your act? <laughs> Why would I do that? I'm like, oh, I don't really set me apart. I'll be a lesbian comic. <laughs> Nobody's ever heard of that before. So I'm going to have to have a drink before I tell you the second thing he asked me. <laughs> He asked me if I wanted to have a threesome. <laughs> and I said no, but only because, I don't know, threesome seems like an awful lot of work. And, <laughs> and if I'm going to work that hard, I want something a little bit more rewarding than two people who are annoyed and disappointed in me. <laughs> like, besides, I, I, like, I'm under no illusions, I know. If somebody wants to have a threesome with me and pretty much any woman I've ever dated, like, I know, I'm, I, I'm like the lima beans on the plate that you have to finish before you get to the dessert. I don't want to be anybody's lima beans. <laughs> You're right, I'm having some issues with my self-esteem. <laughs> I come by it, honestly, though. My last girlfriend, one time I asked her um, why she loved me, and she goes, well, you know how I love everything from the 80s? <laughs> I mean, this is almost gone. I'm going to have to go get another one. I'll buy it. But, but you will? <laughs> I'll meet you out there. <laughs>